Max was on dialysis for approximately one year. It essentially was just keeping him alive until we could move forward with a kidney transplant. Max isn't just another patient. Max is Marvelous Maxwell here. He was my two-year-old baby, and I didn't have any control on how to fix him. There he is. We had to rely on the nurses and the doctors and everybody at Nationwide Children's Hospital. You couldn't possibly put into perspective what, what that child um, has gone through. That whole dialysis is just a delicate process. I mean, he'd have to stay on his bed for 12 hours hooked up to this machine. We've heard stories of, you know, people for years, if not decades, you know, remaining on dialysis until they find a viable donor. <laughs> we were so thankful that I was a match and that I was gonna be healthy enough to donate my kidney to Max. I think in general, it was probably the longest five hours of my life, sitting out in the waiting room. When they came out and told us that everything went well, it's like, it's like winning the lottery, my guy. They saved our little boy's life. And without the nephrology department here, we don't know if we would have our baby. We want to be able to support the hospital so that other families can have that as well and get their babies better. For kids like Max, for other children in the future, I think the passion around the hospital is more about what can we do to help advance medicine? What can we do really to, to have people understand the quality of care here in Columbus? We wanted so bad for things to go well for him. and they did.